I'm going to start by using a primer. This is an affordable primer by Rimmel, the Rimmel London Fix and Perfect Primer. So I'm going to just apply this all over my face. And this primer is very hydrating and long wearing too. So this is the Trife Cosmetics CC Cream and it has SPF of 35. This will be good in Nigeria salt like this will be good. The shade on the CC cream from Trive is Rich Cocoa. I think this is the wrong shade I picked because it's too dark for me. So I'm going to mix it with the CoverGirl Ultra Soft Foundation. And I'll be blending with the Retechnic 202 brush. For concealer, I'm going to use the Huda Beauty. I'm going to use these two shades. One for highlighting and one for contouring. I'm going to take the Huda Beauty brush. Retechnic sponge, Pixie Fisher mix. So, guys, sorry I was interrupted. Now I'm back. The only thing I've done is I've applied setting powder that needs my eyes, and I used the Huda Beauty setting powder, the Huda Beauty Easy Bake powder in the shade Blonde. And I've contour using, not contour, I've set my contouring using the CoverGirl Ebony Bronzer. Then what else? Now I'm doing my brows using the ABH Brow Wiz in the shade, what shade is this? Medium brown. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm going to take the um, Trife Cosmetic Brow Mascara. The P. Louise eyeshadow base. Quick 
crayon case eyeshadow palette the boss of cray this is a very popular eyeshadow palette i think it broke the internet instagram look at the palette I just like the way they know like the name of the palette simple straightforward easy I just kept it simple orange blue green red yellow black brown uh-huh lemon simple must we have to come and read dictionary because we want to apply shadow but I sometimes I don't even mention the name of the eyeshadow I just point it because I can't come at that tan and brown this shade just miss this too as a transition color that would just add as a transition color for the eyes okay i'm going to take the shade called red the shade right here oh my god that is so pigmented no way no way wow i can't that is a lot. Wow. So I shall do this pigmented. I'll come back with the traditional color and use that to just blend. Oh, that looks good. Now let's attempt to cut this crease. I'm going to be using this simple product to cut crease that Huda Beauty launched. This is the Huda Beauty Method Shadow. The Huda Beauty Method Shadow in the shade Wednesday. Oh, so cute. How easy is that product to use? Without doing that, I'm going to take this shade called pink. Like I said, in this crayon palette, they label the product very easy. So I'll take this shade called pink. Huda Beauty product. So make it more pink. I'll just go back to the red shade and the brown shade I'll just use that to define the crease a little bit for eyeliner I'm going to take this technique eyeliner This black liner by Sleek, the Sleek eyeliner. Then I'll blend the transition shade on the crayon palette. I'll blend that underneath my eyes. My top lashes, I'll be using this mascara by CoverGirl. The cover girl mascara. Do the lashes. The next thing is to dust off the excess powder on my face. 
So I'm going to use the BH Cosmetic Pro Matte Powder. This is my face powder. And I use the shade 250 on the BH Cosmetic Powder. A Funcare Cosmetic Blush and Glue Kit. I'm going to take this blush. makeup mixing spray palette i'm going to take the highlighter on this palette this let's try this two shade For lipstick, I'll be using the Huda Beauty. Ooh. Yes, I'll be using the Huda Beauty Power Bullet lipstick. This shade called Ladies Night. Take this shade right here. Okay, guys, this is the final look, and I'm liking the eye makeup. The skin looks beautiful. The crayon kiss palette, the boss of crayon. Yeah, this palette is really good. I would recommend this palette. The pigmentation is nice. I actually like the simplicity of the palette. It's very simple and huge. The names are very simple to follow. Yellow, black, red, green, blue, brown. Simple name to follow. Unlike other palettes I want to like you with names for the huda beauty meta shadow i've already done review of this eyeshadow but they just launched new shade that was a few few months back they added more shade to the to this meta shadow because on that video review i'm going to link it i said that they need to add more colors like put a little bit of yellow blue add a little bit of color and pink and huda beauty came true yeah they watched a lot of review and they came through with the colors of this meta shadow because it's very easy to use if you've not checked out that review make sure to check out the review of this meta shadow the huda beauty power bullet lipstick the one i'm wearing on my lip right now i use the shade poop party and ladies night this combination is cute I like the formula of this lipstick it's really nice full review will be at the description bar or I will link it up here because I'm going to do a full review and lip swatch they have a shade of this lipstick so that's all I have to say about this look if you have any questions let me know in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe if you're not a subscriber tell your friends and family member to subscribe let me know what you like about this look at the comment section and don't forget the hair review will be linked at the description bar of this hair like the description bar or i will link it up here if you want to see the hair review and how i installed this hair and that ghost bone glue is a lifesaver it keeps my wig in place for like a week yes i do shower wash my face anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video remember what i always say be yourself be true to yourself love yourself and do you always remain blessed. Bye, guys. See you.